What is up, Flock? Phoenix Hill here, and welcome back to another Farming Sim 19 Mod Spotlight. This is where we check out some cool mods. I give you guys my thoughts and opinions, and I leave them linked down in the description down below, right below the video, so you too can go download them if you want to. Alright, so, we got, we got, we, we, we got more. I don't know why I do this to myself. I was like, okay, I'm just gonna get these done, and then, uh, everybody releases more mods, and, well, I get, I get, this all right so <laughs> without taking up too much time let's see if we can get through uh as much as this as possible today i want to definitely get through the first four semis that we have from last week oh oh so nice i'm a sucker for these cab overs man but uh we <laughs> have we have a lot to get into so again, like always, if I don't get to a certain mod today, uh, it will definitely be covered next week. All right. Oh, this is it? It's kind of a bummer. Uh, okay, customize, yeah. Oh man, we don't have any light. We have like the light lights, but it doesn't light up on the truck. That's a bummer. That's a real bummer, because I probably would have put this in the server. Uh, oh, I love that engine sound file. I would probably put this in the server as my new truck. The blinkers? No, we just don't have any lights whatsoever. Do we have a horn? We have horn. It's a shame because the interior is so nice. Mirrors work. Everything else works. I mean, it's really lackluster on options. I freaking love the engine sound file. Right. It handles really well. That was because I hit the, the parking. The. What are them things called? Oh my goodness. What are they called? Why can't I think of this? What? I. Oh. Yeah, train, we get it. We get it. If you guys heard that. Train. Brandon's like, oh! Uh, God, what are these things called? I, I, I'm, I'm drawing a complete blank. Oh my goodness. Uh, I'm going to look like a fool. Alright. So. I. I will give this. A 3 <laughs> out of 5. The reason we give it 3 out of 5. Is because there is no options whatsoever. Uh, I would love to see. Like wheel options. Or definitely. At least make this color changeable. So, you know, we can make it black. Uh, I it, it really has no option. There's no options other than color. Uh, and I would love to see, like, I think in the actual, when you buy it, it is... Yeah. I would love to see it look like that. Um, but, yeah, it, it, there's no options to it. So, 3 out of 5, lights don't work. But it handles good. It looks really good feel like it, much like I said in the last videos I feel like it had some tender love and care TLC it would be a pretty awesome mod like I said I I, I really enjoy it I would love to use it in the server just I, I have for me I need lights I need lights and I need I mean some some sort of options I mean I could edit that I can change the color and editor and all that but you know I can change the wheels but I, I much rather see it on the mod, if that makes sense. Anyway, next up, we have Kenworth. First of uh, three Kenworths we have to do today. Woo! Customize. No, again, no options. What is with no options? <gasps> oh. Wait, wait, wait. Can we do this? Why is that dark? And 
Okay, maybe it's the same color, just the shadows. No, wait, that... Wait, did I go with that? We get it. I think what I'm going to do, though... Is there like a pearl white... Oh, yes! Customized, yes. Oh, the fan turns. Wait. We can see out the back window. But it's not that bad. Okay. Alright. Well, at least we do have lights here. We have blinkers. We have blinkers. I forgot to check and see if we have lights. Here. Yep. Okay. Where am I going? The camera feels weird. Is this me or is the camera like... Feels like a fish lens. Am I the only one that notices that? Okay, that's really messing with my eyes. Really messing with my eyes. I, uh, <laughs> I don't know, uh, what. Oh my god. That is. That. That's. Mmm. High speed's supposed to be 93, and it's not getting past 51. See what I'm talking about? Okay, look at look at this. This camera. And look at this camera. This is me is it weird. I don't know, it's messing with my eyes. Um I'll give this one a four. Four out of five. Um the reason we give it four out of five is because um like like that that stuff bothers me. I would much rather just seen it the window blacked out so you just can't see out the back. Um, I know that's weird for me, but I, you know, I just, it, it's just weird that you have this and don't that. Next, um, made the top of this purple. I would love to see the top of the cab purple, uh, just to match. I, I, I've seen this done a lot and I know what it is. People just take, uh, so this, this W900 is probably already a mod somewhere and I probably have covered it. And that's why this here is so short, the, the, frame so short on it because they just took this Kenworth plop this on here and, and put it back out there and it's kind of a bummer it really is and not only that is the Kenworth logo <laughs> is missing it's just all chromed out uh, I would love to see that in red um, but I mean other than that every, the lights work the sound file is a bit wonky and the camera is just it it messes with my eyes so for that, them reasons, I'm going to give it 4 out of 5. Next up, we have a Freightliner. We go from short, short frame to long frame. Oh, this thing got... Got a... Well, it looks like a cat in her. Mm -hmm. Customize. Another one with no options. What is going on now? No options. What's a ooh? Um, I think I might want to do like actually like something like this. Ooh, that looks good. We're gonna go with that. I feel like I've I've seen this interior somewhere. I I'm, I can't place it, but I feel like I've 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 seen this interior somewhere else oh the cowboys don't light up and those are definitely coronas I actually like the way it looks. I'm not a huge fan uh, of 
the stretched frame, but I, I'm not opposed to the way this looks. Not opposed. Not uh, it, it. Not my favorite, but not opposed to the way it looks. All right. Do we have blinkers? We have blinkers. I mean, they made the lights work, but they're just Coronas. They're not the uh, what, what's it called? U U D I M. Oh, I don't know what the new one's called. Everybody asks me, do you, do you know how to mod? Yep, 15, 17. Well, actually, 13, too. 13, 15, 17. I don't know jack squat about 19. I have not attempted it. Just not, not about that life anymore. <laughs> it's just become a just land minefield. Not land minefield. Minefield, there you go. Um, I think I'll stick this one with the Kenworth thing. I think I'll go ahead and give it a 4 out of 5. The reason I'm going to give it 4 out of 5 is this, this is the way I like my lights. Okay, I like them. I like the, they, they use Coronas again. And that's kind of a bummer. I think that might be from the International 4900 interior. I don't know, but they used Coronas. We're we've been spoiled in nineteen with the new lighting systems. Uh, it's a lot better. Uh, Corona should stay in seventeen. Just my opinion. Um, it doesn't have any feature. No, no, are not features options. Uh, it does look good. I will give it credit for that. Um, what was the other thing? Oh, the cab lights didn't work. So for for those reasons, I'll give. Give it a four out of five. Next up, we have our next Kenworth, and this is probably the same. Yeah, this is definitely the same, same freaking Kenworth with a different, different uh, sleeper on it. Absolutely no options whatsoever. Oh my god. <laughs> Looking, I'm looking at you, Kenworth, over there. I, I want some options. Jesus, Pete. At least we're getting to them quicker, quicker, because we don't have the options to go through. Good lord. Oh, this backup is so slow. See, okay, that looks that that's perfect for me. That right there is perfect. It's probably it's probably the same length. It's just the sleeper on it. Um, makes it look a little bit shorter than the other ones. We have blinkers. We have blinkers. We have lights. The cap. The cab lights light up. Horn. Train horns. So see this. It's still it's still a bit bothersome, but it's not as bad as the other one. I mean, there at least there is an interior. You can't see through it. At least it's there. 124, it tops out at 73. All right. Let's, let's put it side by side with the Freightliner just to see the length on it. Yeah, see, hundred percent. Actually, it might be even a little bit longer. Now, hundred percent, it's it's about the same size, but it looks better because of the sleeper. All right. So this one, you know what? I'll give this one. I'll give this one a five out of five. Um. Yeah, I don't. I don't take off for no options. I. I shockingly, I don't. I know I've brought them up in the past three, not having options because if. If they had some sort of options or better options, I, uh, I probably would have bumped them up a little bit. Not going to lie. If I could change the wheels on this one, I might have looked overlooked the lights. Uh, if I could change the color of the frame, I might have overlooked the lights. I don't know. Same with this one. If I could uh, just take the sleeper off, I probably would have given it a 5 out of 5. Because uh, I probably wouldn't even notice the sleeper. And this one, if it had the lights, I would probably overlook the cab lights. So... You know, or even if it had the Coronas for the cab lights, 
probably would have overlooked it. But uh, this one, all the lights work. You know, all the sounds work. Uh, and sounds sound great compared to the other Kenworths. Um, I, I did notice that they, <laughs> they just blacked it out here. Uh, they didn't bother making it red. They just blacked it out. And it's probably the same deal. It's probably, I think it's the same, same cab. And probably what they did is they just made it all black so they because they couldn't do this i'm guessing i'm i'm not 100 certain but i'm guessing that's the case but it would have been i would love to see it color changeable uh even if it, it it's all one color and just the fenders change that would have been fine by me but i will give it five out of five the only thing i i just don't like is that being blanked out all right next up let's get through these fire vehicles before we jump in that kenworth so let's Test this bad boy out. Ho! Ho! Oh my god, holy crap. I like this. I need an H1 and 5M now. Great. Alright, customize. No options. Okay. What you see is what you get. What the heck is that thing? Is that a light? Holy crap, look at the the boom I guess you can call it on that thing we'll save sirens and everything we're just going to test to make sure this that that hooks all right turn the lights on looks pretty good B <laughs> that's That's not a siren. Well, I mean, technically it is, but it's not. Okay. So <laughs> All right, let's turn it off. So, uh <laughs> for those of you who live outside of Delaware, I don't know. I think Maryland does it too. I'm not a hundred percent percent certain. But around here, I know a lot, a lot of your Midwestern states, that means tornadoes coming. Uh, but for Delaware, and a lot of people who move here in Delaware from Midwest freak out when they first hear it. Um, this is a fire whistle. Fire. Fire siren. We call it here in my neck of the woods, we call it a fire whistle. That means there is a fire call. That means... That is a way for the um, the firefighters in my town to be alerted to go to calls. I think, it, as it was explained in a post, there have to be two forms of community or two forms of alerts for firefighters in Delaware. So they have the pagers, or you know, they have the app, the app on the phone now, and they had the the fire whistle. So every time there is a fire call fire whistle goes off that's what we hear uh, it's funny that's being used as a siren for a vehicle I've that that's that's a new one but um, now that Delaware lessons over with um, like I, said, I don't know if Maryland does, I think Mar I, I want to say Maryland does it but I'm not 100% certain um, but anyway I'll give it a 5 out of 5. It looks really, really good. Um, the, I actually really do like the lights on this thing. Um, not so much the light. The light bar is fine, but I like the lights on the rest of it. I don't know. It just, it just looks good. So we'll go ahead and give it a 5 out of 5. Next up. Oh, my goodness. We have a Freightliner. I'm supposed to go with that simp that that tanker back there as a tanker let's see do we have options come on options yes we have options design no rack no rack beacons headache rack headache rack beacons no rack okay doesn't make the beacons go away standard package painted package oh okay I want the chrome package Single exhaust, dual, 
want dual alcohol is no hubs or oh, alcohol is with hubs and let's go with the biggest engine yep customize kind of bummed it doesn't get rid of the beak and this camera is really wonky all right turn on truck it's got the same god dang it all right This is, out of all the, the tankers we've gotten, <gasps> the lights work a little bit. But all the tankers we've gotten, why choose this one as a tanker? Now, this is actually a really good choice for a, uh, for a semi-truck for a tanker because uh, I believe, I believe, no, it's just rim color. Uh, Magnolia Fire Company here in Delaware has a Freightliner just like this. It's red, or not red, it's not red, it's yellow. Oh look, they got... Hey, they managed to do what I did. They got lights on the actual, the tanker to work. Nice. Just a goofy looking tank. Can we fill this with water? Okay, nice. All right. I feel like that's from ETS or ATS, maybe. Oh, thank God for that sign. Am I right? All right. All right. I'm going to give it a... I'll go ahead and give him five out of five, uh, simply because I love, I love, I love that we have someone that, I mean, it's not like, it's not the greatest quality of, of tankers, don't get me wrong, but I love that somebody else has the idea for the semi-tanker, like I had, uh, way back when, um, I just, I just love this, we see, I see these so many, so much around Delaware, a lot of people, uh, don't. But in Delaware, this is this is actually very common. There is, um, let's see, out of the departments around me. So we have my town, the town east of us, the town south of us, or two towns south of us, and. Um, I forget which ones. I know Magnolia has one. So it's like it's like fifty fifty around here that you'll see a semi tanker. I mean, Greenwood has one. Houston has one. Bridgeville has one now. Um, Magnolia has one. There's a lot of them. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying. I'm trying to name them out of memory, but uh, for those of you who are interested in seeing some of those, hopefully, fingers crossed, uh, Greenwood's usually in it. Um, who else? I think I think Houston's usually part of it. Uh, the convoy for Special Olympics of Delaware is this weekend. I should be there. I'm going to try to live stream it and film it at the same time. I know I'm a madman, but I'm going to try. Um, but anyway, I'll give this a, a 5 out of 5. Uh, the only problem I see is those lights. And I'm not a huge fan of this choice of tanker. I feel like um, even, what's his name's Blue Lines uh, trim, ca trim car, wh whatever it's called, tanker would have been a better option than this. <laughs> but, hey, you get what you get. All right, next up, 
we have the utility. Ooh, not a fan of this this sound file, not at all. Let's go ahead and whip her up in here. Customize. No options. Alright. What's this do? Not seeing what. Oh. The, the uh, visor. Alright. Does this do? Okay, that does that. That does the door. What's this do? Okay. Open cover. Oh, dang. Okay. That's pretty rad. So around here, um, I seen that uh, Carlisle has a couple of these, and you use them as traffic units. They have the arrow boards in the back. If you guys follow me on at East Coast Emergency on Instagram, and also on Facebook, uh, I, I I posted a video that showed those two. I've never seen those out and about before, so it was kind of a, a, it's something new. I I captured for myself. I have like a weird fascination with get like capturing videos and pictures of uh, vehicles I've never seen before from local fire companies so you know that was a new one for me but they, they use them as traffic units anyway I'll go ahead and give a 5 out of 5. There's not any options. I do love the doors open. That is something new. Uh, the lighting pattern is not it is is it's pretty good. Um, I'm not a huge fan of the sound file, but other than that, pretty decent. So five out of five. No, let's get to. I'm gonna get to this Kenworth and that. Uh, actually, you know what? I'll call it here. I'll save these four for next week and then load it up with the other ones. <laughs> I really wanted to get to these two trucks because they have a lot of options, but we're almost we're approaching a half hour. So we'll get to the two trucks, the Kenworth and the, the John Deere in next week's episode. So if you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like down below. It does help me out so very, very much. And I do appreciate it so very, very much. If you guys do want to see future uh, Farming Sim 19 Mod Spotlights, be sure to click that subscribe button. And as always, guys, thank you so very, very much for watching. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.